Ruth here, and here we start another uh, Instagram Poke Haul from number six. Yes, number six. So this is from J underscore Pokemon underscore Lover underscore Sales. Uh, if you looked at the uh, giveaway uh, win I got from Jay, the signature card is in that one. Because that's what she meant. Anyway, so these are the cards that I bought. By the way, if you want to know, I do like cut this part out and then keep the front part. So I don't really need to keep the back part. Oh, it's pretty, but it's the same thing. Um, yeah, so I keep it for my uh, Pokemon uh, scrapbook. Now, I think before my mother did say that I hoard things. But uh, yes, that's. Uh, Take off the tape off. So here as you see is the Piplup hollow with the Toys R Us stamp on it. So that is very nice. I do have a couple of Toys R Us ones that I've bought on, uh, like, you know, eBay and stuff. But, um, yeah. Let's see if I can take tape off of this one without it being too finicky. So, one good thing about having long nails, because I actually lost my uh, nail clipper in my bedside drawer, so uh, I do need to find it, but then I can use my nails instead of scissors to open this up, so, as you see, so I don't touch the card, but see, it's, it's a bit long, mom well, it says it's on the long side, I should cut it, sniff them, but uh, yes, I will when I, when I find it. Okay, so this is what I bought. The Jirachi Prism Star and the Latios Prism Star. I'm not really sure why, because I technically haven't bought the uh, booster box of the uh, Celestial Storm yet, so I could pull it, but having two of each of the uh, Christmas star is not so bad as long as I have at least one in each of all of it. Anyway, yes, so this is the first part of this haul. So, yes, um, it doesn't lay anything else to say. Uh, I obviously video these in parts as soon as I get them so I can put them away, you know, keep them safe and stuff. So yes, so, on with the show. This section has, is from Hamilton Poke Plant. I wrote it down there. Anyway, um, doing this on hand, so bear with me. open. Anyway, so we'll do this one and this one. And the sleeves last because they are the holly ones. And here we have the unknown question mark. Unknown U. Unknown N. 
Unknown. See? Oh, that. A reverse hollow W. Reverse hollow P. And a D. So. I decided to split my list into a red hollow and regular. So. Let me just swap hands so I can get my pen. Okay, so D. We have D. Man, it's hard for. Okay, so I don't need D regular. Okay, we got a P reverse. So cross that out. Got a W reverse. Cross that out. We got a Z there. Got an N. Uh, normal. Got a U normal. Anybody normal question? Okay, so we minus quite a few there. Now, for this one is boing. It is H hollow. I don't think I have any hollow uh, unknowns, so I don't really think there are all hollows. Mm -hmm. Did they do the whole set in hollow as well? I don't know. Well that's my first hollow and second hollow would be an N. Very cool. It's pretty resist getting those two as well anyway. So yes, so these are the ones that I still need. Rev hollow, C, D, E, G, I, J, L, N, Q, S, U, V, X, Y, Z, exclamation mark, and question mark. Then for the regular, A, B, C, H, I, L, M, O, P, R, S, T, V, W, X, exclamation mark. So we're getting on. If uh, any of you know where or have any you'd like to send me or I'd buy from you, that'd be most appreciated. So, one of the uh, things I want to complete is the unknowns because uh, I have no idea actually why, but yeah. Anyway, on to the next part. So, part three, and this lot I bought from Canto underscore collectibles. So, Obviously, I'm not showing you the front of the envelope because it has the address. Well, I'll say. Anyway, it does have a nice, uh, nice stamp. Stamps. But, and I'll cut those out and put it in my, uh, thing, uh, Pokemon scrapbook. Yeah, along with this. I think he said that he was going to stop selling soon, I don't know, so check out this, or he said he was going to put it on his eBay, I can't remember anymore, but uh, check out his uh, Instagram, at Kanto underscore collectibles, yeah, it's nice that he's got a round, like a little card here, thank you card, so I can stick it in my thing, so let's just keep this back there, so here are the things I bought. So here he actually signed a, uh, a pick a pack promo. So I could stick that in as well. Stick that next to that. And just to make sure I've got. Okay. I'm pretty sure I had a list of what I bought earlier. I had a list somewhere. Uh, I'm just to double check I got all of it. So, unknown X to go with my unknown cards. So, 
so let me just make sure I've uh, got the piece of paper somewhere. I know if that's chopsticks. Okay, did I lose it already? I lost it already. It's in here. It's in my bedside door somewhere. And, yep, I got it. Yes, and I don't have any X. Reverse hollow or not. And now I have. So there is one hollow. I'm gonna have to change the battery soon, so hopefully I don't cut myself off. So, regular X. Cross it off. Or hey. Right. Um, then what is the next one? We have things sticking together. Okay, we have Rocket's Sneak Attack. That's pretty cool. She's holding a, an Ultra Ball with the letter H on it. Don't know why it's got a H on it. Anyway, that's cool. And here we have another unknown. And this is a Reverse Hollow O. And I needed a regular one, not a reverse one. I, I made this updated list after I bought this, but... Anyway, I can always either resell or keep it as my backup, just in case I lose one. Because I might lose one, you never know. So that's the reverse of. Now here we have one that... One old school one that I've never actually owned. Here is Koga. It's pretty cool. Got the ninja outfit going going on for him. And here we have another one. Lightning plate or yeah, sure whatever on the back. But it's a jungle series crying cube. See? So sad. So couldn't pass it up. Well most of his artwork is sad. But there we have it. Ooh, and next we have a fossil. Still pretty good in condition. Yeah. Pretty, pretty good. And it is dun 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 ditto. Cool. Awesome. So cool. Okay, next we'll uh, go along with my lovely energy cards, even though this is a uh, world championship type of card, so we can't officially play with it, I don't think. But this is double rainbow energy. I like collecting energies too because they're pretty. Okay, and the next card is the awesome. Let me just take it out of the out of the thingy. Okay. Just put this thing in it like the opposite way, because the other other side had the price tag in the way. No the price tag in the way. So I put it in the opposite way. So here you go. Dun, dun, dun. It's Deoxys. As I was saying, it's Deoxys Delta species and the camera battery did die on me, so there we go. Form charge and teleportation burst. This is a very cool old series Pokemon. And plus, I don't really, really mind too much about old old school ones, but it's a legendary and I don't have very many Deoxys cards in my collection. Because I'm Izo. And it was only 8 bucks. So. It's very pretty and shiny. Lovely. 
the Deoxys isn't really a favorite legendary of mine, but I thought, you know, mine as well. It's nice that it's got these little pull tab things, and much easier to get out of the top loader with these pulley thingies. But I guess they're like plastic things. And tabs. Anyway, here is Teammates Full Art Trainer. I quite like this one. And this one was also 8 bucks, so I could not resist. I don't have it anyway, so. And it's a very, very, uh, cheerful, cheerful card, I guess. Cheerful card, I can't speak. Uh, yeah, so that is all of the cards. Just put this up here. Normally, I don't really bother putting, you know, normal cards in sleeves when I take them away. But for the old school ones, I'll keep them in their sleeves. I'll just turn the sleeves around so the price tag's not fit. <laughs> but yeah, I want to keep them as uh, in the condition that I bought them. You know. For collection purposes, obviously, you know. I think you're picky that way. But anyway, yes, yeah, so that was it. So check out Canto Collectible. And yeah. So I believe that, that is it for this part. I might have one more section in this Hobby Hall number six, or am I not? You shall see, so if there is, I'm pretty sure I'll put another one. One more person I bought from in the next, then I can edit all this together. So, as I said, check out him, it's very nice. And yeah, so thank you for watching, like and subscribe for more. On to the next part. Here is the last uh, installment person. Anyway, the last part for the uh, Poke Hall number six, I think. It's number six, anyway. It should be number six. Okay, so here are the three cards I bought. And he was nice enough to include some freebies. So let's look at these. So, he didn't want to send internationally, so I had um, sent to my good friend uh, Jay, which was, you know, J underscore, underscore, uh, the underscore Pokemon underscore, uh, the underscore lover. And she's in, like, the first person in this haul. Anyway, so, her link should be below anyway. So, we have a Clefairy. We got a Hoopa, Ooh, a Frogadoo, um, Vantyke, that's cool, I don't think I have that. We got a Pikachu from Evolutions, and a Salazzle from Ultra Prism, and ooh, Clefable Reverse from Guardians Rising, I think. So nice. So those are the freebies, after the cards that I bought. So I think it was like five dollars a card. I can't remember. Okay, so first one is, ah, uh -huh. so we have a Lysander's trump card, full art trainer. I figure since I have a Lysander full art, I might as well have one relating to him for another one. Okay, next one is Mega Mewtwo EX and 
the these are the full arts, yes, because they got texture. Hashtag texture. Anyway, um, well, I'm just anyway, um, what am I saying? Uh, yes. So I don't think I got these. I mean, these are from Breakthrough, I think. But um, yeah. I have like a normal EX version of at least one of these. And I thought, you know, I might as well, if it's only $5 car, you know? So, yeah. So, these are the awesome cards that came with lovely freebies. So, thank you. Uh, I actually never said your name, did I? Uh, I think it was Canto. Or native. Or... Let me look you up. <laughs> I can't believe I forgot. Um, because there wasn't any sign card or anything. Yes, Canto native. Canto underscore native. If you want to be uh, exact. So he doesn't have any sale going on right now, but here it is. Canto underscore native. So check him out, he's got other cool posts anyway, but no uh, sales at the moment. So yeah, so thank you for watching, like and subscribe for more. Um, ring that doorbell for notifications, over and out.